Listen, okay. Today, just today, mm -hmm. I, I I was in Portsmouth and picked these up. Okay. I love it I here. I haven't seen these before. Yeah. What's, yeah. What? Take one for okay. yourself. Uh, this We're is a this is a, a photo contest that is being sponsored by a bunch of new Hampshire organizations, and what what they're asking is people take their picture with this sign and something very New Hampshire-ish. Okay. Like what would that be? Think, um, uh, uh, gosh, uh, maple sugar. Yeah, mountains. Uh, yeah. Uh, a moose. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Lakes, um, lilacs. All of those are right. in season. Lupin. Um, you get it. Yeah. Anyway, take your picture with these, with this sign, and uh, send it into nhdreamvacation.com. The reason I'm talking about this is because I would really like to see someone from Wolfboro win this dream vacation. Okay. And I mean. We have so many creative people here in Wolfboro that you can really... And so many landmarks in Wolfboro. I mean, yeah. You could, you could use the oldest summer resort in America sign. Uh, the public restrooms. Which, by the way, I think we have the most charming public restrooms in the world. We do? Yes! In fact, I think right now we should sponsor a contest. Anyone who thinks they have more charming restrooms, public restrooms, downtown, just take us on. Because ours are the most charming. It's like gingerbread house. So I guess email us a picture yeah. of the most charming restroom at wolf101 New Hampshire at gmail.com. Yeah. I'm not really sure where this is going to go. but Well, come on. It's going to be fun for everyone. I dare you to find a more uh, charming restroom <laughs> than Wolf Girl. Yeah. I'm glad, <laughs> I'm glad you're on board with it. I, I think it's more <laughs> that much. Dodger's my puppy, mm -hmm. and he's going to be a service dog, uh, potentially, with an organization called Canine Companions for Independence, which uh, reminds me of a local group we have called Axe, mm -hmm. and Axe is a group right here in the greater Wolfboro area, led by um, Dorothy Hyde Williams, mm -hmm. and she raises dogs and places them with people who need assistance, etc. So anyway, you can find that information at our... Facebook page, etc. Absolutely, yep. But uh, in any case, Dodger is my puppy for now. But okay. I've got to turn him in in 300 days. He's just really nice and sweet and well behaved. And but a puppy. Yeah, he's a puppy. Just and like you can take to. him to parties. Yeah, I think he'd be pretty good at a party. We're just going to go to the fridge. Alright, let's look. See if you can answer this question, and it is on our Facebook page. Wolf's Tavern has been serving up food, fun, and spirits since... You tell us. Oh, visit our page. Email it, email it to wolf101nh at gmail.com. Or go to Facebook. And answer it and there. And like Wolf101 and then answer the question there. Right. Uh, Wolf's Tavern. Buffalo Wings. Mm -hmm. The restaurant. Uh, pizza. Wolf City or Wolf Gangs. Uh, guacamole. I so knew this one. El Centenario. Flatbread with a view. Uh, Garwoods. And nachos. Uh, Bayside, uh, Bayside uh, Grill and Tavern. So, okay, so some things to be looking forward to as we move on to new episodes. Um, we have some topics we'll be discussing, one being the real housewives of Wolfboro. You've seen them in Jersey, you've seen them in Orange County, and you've seen them in New York, but you have not seen them in Wolfboro. So Wolf 101 is the place to hear about it. So we'll be talking about that. Mm -hmm. I think we have an exclusive, actually. We're oh, we gonna, do? Yeah, we're going to oh. be able to actually tape them while they're shooting. And I don't know what, net, what network it's going to be on, but this has been. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So. Okay. Um, and uh, a food show. Amy is yeah. going to tell us about the food show. It's with a woman who lives on the lake, and she cooks on Sundays, and she has these adorable sous chefs, and it's going to be a really good. So 
It's going to be a good show. We're going to be there again. We're going to get, we right. get to take. First look right here. Yep. Wolf 101. That's right. Channel 25. Awesome. Well, okay. Well, do we want to just talk about it? Because I feel like, I feel like we should let the viewers in. Okay. I, this was, a, I mean, it was a true bonding moment. I felt like. I was really excited when you asked me to be in the parade. You know, I've right. never been in the parade. In so, my, so I don't know. In my so whole life, we carried we carried the banner for the Cape Park band, um, which was so fun. Mm -hmm. um, and we brought my son. We were right in the front of the parade. Oh, you didn't you didn't know that my stomach oh, dropped. Okay. And and we 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 marched and mm -hmm. we were happy. I think we might. Do we have some footage of that? Um. But okay. So listen, if you want to know how to stop a parade and, In its tracks. and silence the onlookers, mm -hmm. I'm the girl. <laughs> while you're holding a toddler. And I don't just... think we should say asphalt. <laughs> <laughs> we, we should not say We should drop asphalt. asphalt. <laughs> we should drop. You, you, if you want to drop to the pavement. <laughs> I think it was asphalt. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was whose fault? <laughs> but thanks for joining us here in the basement. Yes, I'm Megan. And I'm Amy. And this is Wolf 101.